But what's up guys, Everything Apple Pro here, and it's coming to my attention that there's a new bug in iOS, or newly discovered, that permanently breaks your device. So for informative purposes, I will be recreating this bug on my iPhone 5S and show you how it's done and what can be done to fix it. Now by permanent, uh, it's a little of a skewed term here because it is permanent. If you restore your device, it will not fix the issue. There are two ways to fix it, and I'll get to that. Uh, and uh, first, let's talk about compatible devices. So uh, this works on any firmware, iOS 8, iOS 9. I haven't tried older firmwares, and it works on 64-bit devices. So 5S, 6, 6S, uh, and pretty much any other device using a 64-bit chip, A7 and up. Uh, so uh, got a 5S here. I'm going to go ahead and show you I'm on the latest firmware about 9.2.1. So how do we do this bug? So all you got to do is go into general, go into date and time. And we're going to do a little time traveling here. Let's go back to uh, 1970. So you want to scroll all the way up and it's uh, quite a little bit of scrolling. So when you're actually doing the date trick, you wanna make sure not to leave this page. But when you reach the end, just scroll down again and it'll boot you to, I think, five years difference, then do it again and again, and you'll get to 1970. So you wanna go to January 1st, 1970. I mean, you don't wanna do this, just watch, but January 1st and time can be whatever. So that's all you need to do. Make sure uh, set automatically is off, of course. So. Now, if you restart your device, your device will fail to boot. And this is something that can definitely be fixed by software. The uh, actual description as to why this happens, it's available, I'll include it down below in the description. It's basically the way that the clock is counted, the seconds, and we're resetting the seconds to zero, 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 basically when this system was put into place. Now, uh, it's kind of interesting because this reminds me a little bit of Y2K. I was only a kid back then, but everyone was freaking out about the computers not being able to handle you know, the numbers, and now, this bug here it is in 2016 on the latest iPhone. So basically your phone will sit on this screen right here, the startup, and uh, you're done. Now, the only way to fix this is to take your phone apart and take the battery connection out. You have to reset the PRAM, and the only way to do that on an iPhone is to unplug the battery or leave your device and let it physically die. But warning, it gets extremely, extremely hot Basically, the device went into negative time value, so you know it counts by a matter of seconds, and now it's negative seconds, and the phone can't compute that. There's a little bit more reasoning behind it. I'll leave that link down below, but man, this is such an interesting bug. I've never, uh, never really heard of anything like it besides the text message bug, but it wouldn't permanently leave your device in this state. And the interesting thing is, if you restore in this state, nothing will change. It will still sit here. You literally have to wait for your battery to die, unplug the battery, or you can always take it to Apple and have them take a look at it. You will most likely end up getting your device replaced because this is not fixable by a software restore. So um, I'm gonna go ahead and take this guy apart and uh, get the battery undone. Show you guys what happens after that. This is so dang interesting. And how I do encourage you guys to take my word for it because if you do do this, trust me, it is not a fun process to go and find the tools, take your phone apart or uh, wait for it to die or even take it to Apple Store. It's just, you know, why go through that? So take uh, my word for it, take the other people that have done it. Now I didn't have to completely disassemble the device, just uh, pry the screen open, get in there and uh, take the battery connection out and you're good. It resets the PRAM. When you turn your device on, it'll be back to the time where it should be. It was a little interesting. It was like a little buggy and the display clock looked so interesting. I've never seen it like that. So quite an interesting experience. Not something I expected to find today. All right, so thanks so much for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed this little bug video. I'm always interested in these. You know, your device will just keep restarting. It'll never boot up. This is such an interesting bug. And that makes three, I think, for iOS 9.2.1 right now. One is this one. Two is Crash Safari. That's able to crash your phone just by uh, loading a link. And I do have a bypass into the photos and contacts that still works on the latest firmware. So Apple's got quite a bit of working to do to fix up their firmwares. Have a great day, guys. Do not do this to your device. You will regret it. Trust me. Peace.